Well, hello folks, welcome back. My name is Stephanie Canada. If this is the first time we're meeting, I do all types of random things on this channel, including thrifting and occasionally opening up giant boxes full of patterns that I do not remember what's in them. In them? In them. That's good words. So yes, indeed, what we are doing today is I am going to be taking this giant, not HelloFresh box, but I mean, hey, if you feel like sponsoring a gal, you know where to find me. Uh, yes, my friend sent me these patterns that she got from her grandmother and I don't know what's in them because I'm pretty sure she sent me photos and they went in one ear and right out the other. So I guess that makes this a more entertaining video because you're gonna get my live reaction because I don't remember what's inside. Welcome to my brain. Anyways, there's no real need to chat for all this. Let's do the thing. Uh, don't actually open patterns like that. Be better than me. I should mention that while I'm doing this, God, don't slice my hand open. I will also be chatting about the channel and what we are looking forward to in 2022, which is a mixture of things. So stick around. It's going to be a good time. Patterns. Merry Christmas. You tell, can you tell I didn't open this on time? I'll open that later. Thank you, friend. Why am I the worst? All right. So first things, since we're talking about Christmas and puppy love quilt, it's cute, but I, I have no idea. Oh, and a cuddle cat quilt too. Excellent. We need to address the giant elephant in the room that is in the shape of a giant Christmas tree, also known as Vlogmas. Uh, I failed. I, I'm sure you all realize that. I also realize that. Vlogmas was a very last minute thing for me. I think I decided to do it uh, like three days before December. Not my best plan. So I do apologize for those that were expecting videos from me every day because that's what I said I was gonna do. Okay, terrible noise time. Well, they're in a little bag. Okay, hang on. Gotta get them out. Oh my God. <laughs> Busy body. <laughs> oh, look at that drop waste. Oh boy. That is, that is something. Baby basics. Very 90s. Oh wait, 80s. I think I'm a liar. Where's your date? 88. And, oh, that's cute. I have no idea what size it is. Size flagon, oh, flagon. Oh, she never used it? No, she did use it. She just folded it back really. No. no. She never used it. Just was in there awkwardly. Uh, yeah, so I do apologize for those that were expecting videos from me daily because that did not happen. Size 12. Why am I not surprised? I also want to let you know that there are some things to expect from the channel. Number one, I have two Christmas related videos half done <laughs> and a non Christmas related video that should have been published in December because it would have done really well. That is also not done. One of them I should be able to take with me on this new endeavor and finish it while I'm there. So hopefully that one at least will be published eventually. Um, but yes, so there are videos that could possibly be coming if I can get them done between now and January 1st, <laughs> which is questionable. No. So there's that. So there are, there will be some like random Christmas content. I would like to get it out in December, at least one of them. Cause it's like, it's well on its way to being done. So if the other one has to go by the wayside, then it goes by the wayside, but look forward to some very poorly timed Christmas content because I'm the best with timings. Survey said. Okay. Let's look at some more patterns. Uh, let's look at some, some something. Barbie dress, Northern Spy, October 17th, 94. Sure. So DIY Barbie dress. Another plastic bag full of things. Oh, that's cause they're just tissue paper. Oh, that's terrifying. Smocking, some type of smocking situation. What are we looking at smocked wise? Oh, it's a heart pillow. Oh, it's a heart pillow and a square pillow and a little, a little roundy one too. That's cute. I, I don't know if it's complete. Um, I'll have to check because it was just kind of tucked into that bag. So we'll have to check on that. I, I don't know. And now the reason for this update is because I have operas coming up. Hooray! Wait, opera? What is that? She says, really hoping she didn't just jinx it. Where's some wood? There! As I knocked my microphone off. A few moments later. So yeah, there's, there's opera coming soon to, uh, 
theater near you, hopefully, I will be in North Carolina working with North Carolina Opera, and we have a show. It feels very weird to say that. I'm not going to lie. So <laughs> uh, that's the reason why there will be a hiatus in January, not just because it's the typical YouTuber hiatus. It's because I actually will be in a completely different state. I will be away from my husband's computer, which is actually where I've been doing all of the fancy new editing because my sad computer uh, can't even open DaVinci Resolve. It is too powerful for the 2013 MacBook to handle. So if you see videos going up in January, they have either been edited on my very old 2013 MacBook in iMovie with very bare bones, or I somehow managed to finagle enough cash to wrangle up a new MacBook and now I can work DaVinci and it will be fantastic. I don't know which one of these things is going to happen, but one of them is going to be the answer. Don't know which one yet. More patterns. Now your next question may be, Stephanie, are you going to be recording videos in North Carolina? And the answer to that is, absolutely I am. And dear God, one of them I'm kind of terrified about because it's a, it's scary. Oh no. <laughs> kind of like, the, why is that pig in a tutu? <laughs> pig in a tutu. I cannot. The cows are actually like, they at least make sense, but the pig in a tutu. Oh boy. Uh, looks like we have another, oh, we have a sunbonnet Sioux quilt situation. That's, that's what's happening there. So yes, I am recording videos while I am in North Carolina. I can think of at least two that I hope to do. One of them I'm doing whether I like it or not, because it's a big ask and a big, dear God, why? But that's what we do on the internet, right? Is is do dumb things so that people will watch it and laugh at our misery? I'm pretty sure that's what the internet was made for. And even if it's not, that's what I use it for. So yeah, that's really what we're going with here. Whoa, uh, oh, um, there's still fabric in one of these. McCall's 7480. Not sure which one you are, but we will open up these plastic bags and find out. Bam. Poodle skirt. And another poodle skirt, sure. And does not look like a poodle skirt. Oh, that's kind of like a, it's interesting. It's sort of like a little sack dress situation. It's tiny, but we're not surprised by that. And another skirt, very 2000s. Pretty sure I had at least one of those. Oh, and whoa, nope, that's not, that's a doll one. Yikes. Okay, from me to you though, uh, the reason you don't see many doll clothes patterns on my website is because I literally hate checking them because of that. There are so many tiny pieces and nine times out of 10, you do not have all of them. And it's very frustrating. So I don't, I, I apologize. I, I just don't like to do it. So there's that. And this is why, like, look, we have this whole envelope right here. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Them. <laughs> they I don't know where the rest of that pattern is. So maybe it's in here, I don't know. But yes, I also want to say real quick that I really appreciate all of you. I appreciate the fact that you watch my videos. I appreciate the fact that I get that not every video I'm going to put out, everyone wants to watch. It's totally fine. I, I get it. I totally understand but I appreciate that there's a fair amount of you that still come back for almost every video. And I appreciate anyone who spends any amount of time on my channel and doesn't go, oh God, what is she? Why is she so sarcastic? It's just who I am. Like people ask like, why do you put on this front? Why do you do all this? This is just kind of how I am, but amped up a little bit. Like it, it's still me. It's just, turned up to 11 instead of like at nine where I normally sit. So I don't know what to tell you kids, but I do want to thank you all so much and know that me not putting out videos is absolutely not me going, Oh God, I don't want to do this anymore. Cause I really like this. I, I wish I was better at editing and faster at editing. I did get a little faster during vlogmas, but not, not enough to be, super speedy fast. It still takes me three days or four days or a week to do one of those, uh, like especially the sewing videos, because there needs to be such a timeline to it. I want to thank you for being here and for watching and for 
hopefully laughing along with me sometimes and occasionally putting me in my place. Like I respect that all of you aren't just like, I agree with her all the time. Like you don't have to do that. Like, please, if there's something that I've gotten wrong, like that you know is like, no, no, no. Like with the walk away dress, when you all informed me that the instructions for you were super helpful. I'm totally open to that. Like I was just there to compare the two and point out things and be a little sarcastic in the process. But thank you for telling me and thank you for standing up and be like, mm, actually, I'm gonna need you to slow your roll there, Stephanie, because those are useful. So thank you. Thank you for being a good checks and balance for me. And thank you for being here. I appreciate you, I really do. Okay, before I start crying, let's go with more patterns. I don't know what else is in this box. Let's find out. Okay, looks like we have another sleepy teddy quilt. Cute. I think these are all Cranston VIPs. They are. The, the gingham goose patterns and pretties. Like I said, I don't remember what's in here. Oh boy. That, that was in my house. abso freaking lootly and most of my friends' houses growing up. Oh my god. Oh, my mom would have made this. Absolutely. 100% she would have. 7480, was that the one I had earlier? Yes! Hooray! <laughs> we have we have a match! Huzzah! The skipper pattern. Fantastic. Good. I'm so glad. And we have a super cute witch costume, which I have to say is, is very cute. All here for 10 cents. How long ago was that? Oh boy. Yeah. Okay. Very 90s. Uh... Oh, and it's the whole outfit. You can do the vest and the pants. Winning. What else we got? Oh, not much left. Okay. Uh, we're probably gonna nix the box for the last one. Boop! Ooh. All right, last bag. But yes, I do see exciting things coming to the channel, such as, why is the dog outside? <laughs> okay, hang on. A few moments later. What I was trying to say was that there's going to be still lots of fun sewing projects and thrifting projects projects, adventures, thrifting adventures, and just general shenanigans on the channel. Um, don't, do not lick my mic. So I do want to, let's get through this last stack before the dog eats my microphone. Then we'll wrap this up. So here we have a McCall's from the 2000s, very drapey sleeves. Another McCall's probably newer, much more baby doll 70s vibe. Ruffles, all the ruffles. When is this? This looks very new. Why Why do you have to move the date, McCall's? Why? 2007 is when this bad boy is from. I mean, it's fine. It's pretty standard. It's a good pattern. Cute little pajamas and a robe and some PJ bottoms because we all love good PJ bottom. What in the world? How to thread new cord and traverse rod. Huh? <laughs> um, okay. Cool. If anyone needs these instructions for a traversing rod, let me know. I will send them to you. They are, I have no need for those. Here we got a fun little tent dress, probably from the early 2000s, because that looks like real inspired by the 60s. Oh boy. <laughs> ah, Waverly, yeah baby. Yes, Grandma Chic is here with the Waverly patterns. Absolutely it is. Oh, now that one's cute. It's a two piece. But that is cute. I like the darts. I like the bow. Simplicity 7481. Probably 70s mid. Yeah, 76. And size 12 at that point is a 34. So, I mean, it's a smaller size, but it's still cute. And we have something. Simplicity. Doll size upper skirt. Uh, 3669 is what that says right there. And, oh, no. Oh no. <laughs> well, I mean, thank you for writing on the envelope so that hopefully I can put them back with their friends. Uh, 4510, 40, so this all looks like pattern 4510. Now, are they all hand-drawn? I don't know. No, they're actual, the real tissue. I mean, it's fine. Everyone has their own organization system, but now I'm just like, oh, where's the envelope for you? Mm, dang it. Cause I'm, I like to put them back where they go with their original friends. That's what these all are. So all, doll thingies 4700 ah there she is 4510 right there with hey look a lovely little sewing pin right there sit thank you oh good and 4700 which was the bag right below it also now has its friend 
hooray. And that's all that was in that little box. Just a fun little easy opening. Wanted to chat with you a little bit about the channel. Let me know if there's any projects in particular that you're looking forward to in 2022. Maybe you have ideas that you'd like to see come. Stop nudging the mic, please. So if there's any projects in 2022 that you particularly would love to see me bring to the channel, make sure you leave them down below. While of course, hopefully clicking that like button if you enjoyed this and subscribing if you are new or maybe if you just hadn't gotten to it yet. Also, just so you know, all the communication with from me to you will be on the community tab. I can speak English some days. Either that or through Instagram. Instagram will just be for more for fun because I, I have no idea if I will be able to put out a video in January. In the grand scheme of things, I would love to do that, but I don't know if it's going to be possible because I will also be putting up a show in 2022 at the same company that I got sent home from on March 13th of 2020. It's not the same show. We're not exactly bookending it, but we're darn close. And hey, if you are in the Raleigh-Durham area, come late January, come see La Boheme. We will be there, hopefully performing. Huzzah! Somehow, we will make it through this. Please go get your vaccinations, because I love you and I would like to have you around the channel a little bit longer. Until next time, friends. See you later. Okay. Make sure you can see what's inside. Oh, you totally can. Excellent. Gonna bring it on down. Bring it on down now. Bring it on down now. We we have a candy in a cone because she's still licking her leg. Huzzah. Oh my gosh, puppy. Ma'am, what was with the interruption? I'm just gonna fix that. They have been yeeted from the table. Stop licking the mic. Candy also. Said bye. That'll go in the outtakes, won't it? Use the wheel.